While we in the West drink millions of gallons of black tea each year, green tea has ruled the roost from Tokyo to Tibet for 4,000 years. Green tea became popular in the UK in the 17th century and was a Brit's tea of choice for many years. It then fell out of favour and black reigned supreme. These days, green is the talk of the town once more, sometimes because of the perceived health benefits. There are claims it can help lower cholesterol and blood pressure. Green teas are by their very nature refreshing and vary from stronger, more verdant to sweet and floral flavours. There are countless varieties, Dragonwell or Longjing, Angie Bai Cha and Mao Fung from China, Hyokoro and Sencha from Japan. In China, the first picking of the year before the Qingming Festival is the most highly prized. Some Chinese green tea leaves are fired in special woks soon after picking to protect the colour and flavour and as a result have a more roasted taste. The Japanese, on the other hand, prefer to steam their leaves. Many varieties have unique preparation and pouring rituals, particularly in Japan, to bring out the very best taste. All green teas should be made with cooler water, so you don't scald the leaves. The best green teas are delicate, so boiling water will bring out tannins and impair the complex, subtle flavour. It's traditional in China and Japan to make a small pot of tea and share with friends and family. And the very best teas should be savoured slowly. Why not try some green tea and create your own ritual? <laughs>